Welcome back to our channel, where we provide updates and previously undisclosed narratives on Catherine, Princess of Wales, and her royal family. We bring you the following news. Queen Camilla was banished from Buckingham Palace after an outburst on Harry's birthday. Buckingham Palace in England is now under significant strain. Prince Harry's birthday has provoked a spectrum of emotions elation for some but not for others. Queen Camilla Parker Bowles is among those displeased. In this episode of Secrets of the King, we explore this scenario. Kindly like this breaking news video, subscribe and activate notifications for updates. Please share your opinions about Queen Camilla in the comments section below. Queen Camilla has mostly been missing from media coverage with King Charles and has not been spotted recently with Prince William. This background sheds light on recent occurrences. September 15 marked Prince Harry's 40th birthday, the youngest son of King Charles. Despite being unable to attend the conference, the King dedicated himself to a two-hour video chat, a move that caused discord in response to his son's request. King Charles postponed royal obligations, prompting Queen Camilla to argue against abandoning royal engagements for a birthday celebration. King Charles clarified that the occasion is not just any birthday, it is that of his exiled son. King Charles suggested to Camilla that Harry may unexpectedly return to England, which greatly disturbed Queen Camilla, who remains haunted by previous conflicts. The crucial question persists. Can Queen Camilla affect the relationship between Charles and Harry? The British royal family has had a tumultuous year. The Princess of Wales has found herself at the forefront of some challenging circumstances. On Monday, royal enthusiasts expressed relief as she formally announced the completion of her chemotherapy. In an updated clip, the sight of Carol and Michael Middleton delighted royal fans worldwide. Renowned for their steadfast resilience and commitment, Catherine's parents were frequently present at Amher Hall, where Kate and her family often gathered throughout her chemotherapy treatment. Michael and Carol took on a more active role in caring for their grandchildren, strengthening Michael's connection with the royals and reassuring the princess that her children were in affectionate, competent hands. Catherine expressed a poignant tribute to her parents, acknowledging their steadfast support throughout an exceptionally difficult period. The short film offered a glimpse into the princess's life, serving as her most intimate family video. Carol and Michael were shown engaged in a card game with the prince, princess, and grandchildren, revealing a lighter aspect of Catherine's health struggle. Last month, the Wales family recorded these familiar familial images in Norfolk, where their vacation residence is located. Royal enthusiasts have meticulously scrutinized recordings of the princess's family engaging in recreational activities in the woods at the beach and playing cards on picnic blankets and at the dinner table. In one poignant tribute to his late paternal grandfather, Peter Middleton, a fighter pilot, photographers captured William and Catherine playing a customized card game from the Battle of Britain series on a picnic blanket. In 1962, Prince Philip accompanied the princess's grandfather, Captain Peter Middleton, on an RAF expedition to South America. The Duke, a passionate aviator, piloted the aircraft 49 times, with Captain Middleton by his side. The Wales family's video demonstrates their economical approach to scoring in the game, using coffee capsules for each participant positioned at the center of the dining table. The family seems to enjoy card games, as evidenced by video from their picnic showing them enjoying an assortment of cards provided by the RAF Battle of Britain Squadron. Their family pastimes evidently foster a spirit of amicable competitiveness among them. Royal engagements recognize William and Kate for their competitive nature, during an episode of Mike Tyndall's podcast this past summer, the princess humorously mentioned that the pair never completes a tennis match, noting that it transforms into a mental struggle between them. When Mike inquired if their three children had shown signs of competitiveness, the princess said, slightly, I would assert. 
This year, the Prince and Princess of Wales observed their 13th wedding anniversary. They had known each other for nearly 20 years, having met as undergraduates at the University of St. Andrews. The pair's childhoods were markedly different. William grew up in royalty, while Catherine experienced a typical middle-class upbringing. Upon accepting William's proposal during a romantic trip to Kenya, the princess recognized that this decision would significantly alter her life, exemplifying her love for her prospective spouse. William allegedly promised Carol and Michael Middleton that he would always support her, fully aware of the personal sacrifices she was making to be with the man she loved. In light of her present health challenges, she stated that William would make every effort to support her and prioritize the well-being of their little family, regardless of the time required. Please subscribe to Secrets of the King for more exclusive content and leave your comments. We value your input. Although the public is used to seeing these young royals in their perfect family photographs and formal events, a delightful transformation has been occurring behind palace walls. The film, which featured the Prince and Princess of Wales and announced the conclusion of Princess Catherine's treatment, was captivating in its portrayal of a personal occasion. In a touching moment, Prince Louis embraced his mother on her right side. Responses arrived swiftly with one user stating, Louis resembles a teddy bear, I truly adore him. It is heartwarming to see them really interacting with their children. Another praised the footage while admonishing Sussex supporters, referred to as sugars, stating, their children are remarkably well-adjusted and filled with affection. Contrary to the assertions made by the sweets, children cannot pretend to be that way. They appear content, so they must be William, a proud father of three, enthusiastically discussed his children while speaking with students at Swiss Valley Community Primary School. A charming video that gained widespread popularity featured 10-year-old Ruby Davis presenting the air with a postcard book created by school pupils, along with friendship bracelets for both the Prince and Princess. Prince George and Princess Charlotte recently revealed their status as Swifties after attending Taylor Swift's era's tour with their father. They managed to get a prized selfie with Taylor herself. However, it seems that their younger brother, Louis, at six years old, may want the bracelet if his siblings are not vigilant. Moved by the gesture, William said to Ruby, Thank you immensely. They will appreciate these. You will see them often. I will protect them from Louis, who will try to seize his sister's belongings. Louis and George are gaining attention beyond their endearing behaviors and playful smiles. Reports indicate they are developing a profound and emotionally resonant relationship. According to sources close to the family, George, the future monarch, has assumed a more protective elder brother role, embodying his responsibilities with a soft and nurturing demeanor reminiscent of his father. Prince Louis, characterized by his cheerful nature and exuberant energy, is keen to emulate his older brother, seeing George as both a role model and companion in their enjoyable adventures. Their sister Charlotte also monitors Louis, ensuring he adheres to proper behavior during formal occasions. In one heartwarming instance, Charlotte discreetly instructed Louis to lower his arms during the national anthem, subtly prodding her brother to swiftly place his arm behind his back. Catherine, the Princess of Wales, burst into laughter as she witnessed Charlotte's sisterly gesture clearly relishing her children's bond. 